All right, Facebook, YouTube, Mr. Game, everybody online. Happy Friday. Uh, we're in beautiful Maryville, Illinois. Today's Friday 26 for a client that booked uh, two weeks ago. Uh, we cleaned the carpet and re-protected it yesterday. We came out today, and now we're removing their um, over-the-counter products on their hardwoods, getting that removed, and they're going to clean and buff it and get it back to original state. And uh, it's going to be a good one, guys. Um, they're excited to get it done. Uh, we got Bridget on the schedule with us today helping us out. And uh, we're doing this service right here. So we're going to remove their, their wax. They're going to clean and buff it. So, which is two different services, guys. All right. Not a bad day today. Let me show you what we're doing. All right. So we did those yesterday. So what we're going to do today is Bridget starts to set up and start uh, vacuuming. Is we're doing... These hardwoods, getting all the topical products removed. Now again, this is a pre-finished floor, but you can just see how it has marks and indentions and things like that. That's because you guys know the over-the-counter products doesn't cure. So we're gonna remove those and then clean and buff it and get this floor back to the original state. And uh, the lighting ain't really good in here, but you can kind of see um, if I go back here, and just look, you can just see just all the marks and scratches in these floors. And that's because the, the quick shine has been put on this. And uh, this client knows what not to do. Just look right there, guys. See all that? Smudges and screaks. Yep. And it's more of the same in here. So we got the spoiler. We got the dining room. And Mark's going to move this table out of the way once we get to this point. But uh, got some UV damage from a rug. Don't you guys see that? That's another topic, but yeah, if you ever have this kind of problem, always get a uh, UV rate uh, tent on windows so you don't have any off-gassing and um, it will sunburn your floor. <laughs> but uh, just see, look at here, guys. Try to get a capture on camera. See all that? Smudges and how that's just, you know, grummy and grimy. Yep, that's that over-the-counter products. Look at this right here, over here. You guys see that scratch on the floor? That's in the product, not in the, not in the hardware. So well, that's all going to be removed. Look at that, guys. Wow. So, and also right here. So, um, that's what we're going to do today. Get all this stuff off. And then uh, we're going to get it back to Ridge State. In fact, Ridge, move out of the way a minute. I'm going to show, the, I'm gonna show the, these guys on camera. You just see, if I, if I click the zoom in here, just all those smudges. Like right through here. And that's what their the big concern is they just got tired of looking nasty and uh, not its best. And uh, just right through here. Look at that guy. Just, I was just smudgy. Yep. So we're going to remove that, emulsify it, and then uh, we're going to clean and buff it. And a lot of streaks there too. And then once we do that, this floor will be back to the original state and they can enjoy it for years to come. So if you guys have this kind of flooring, um, give reach out, give us a call. Look at that right there, a little scratch right there. Um, we got you covered. So, and again, I told the client if we clean a buffet, and it sometimes because the wear layer can wear off the aluminum oxide, it could be uneven in some spots. So, if that's the case, what we'll do is we'll apply a preservation finish, and we'll just apply um, either we can do to do a satin or we can do a semi gloss um, protection, which is a urethane that we could just you know apply on. And uh, that will help make everything look uniform. I told them that we wouldn't recommend doing that until we clean a buffet to just see how it all looks. Now, if it pops, you know, and it pop, pops the sheen and everything looks good, then, you know, I'm not going to charge them extra for that. We, we don't got to do that step. But if it is, he knows then, of course, we're going to put that, apply that product. Um, and then it's going to make everything look nice and uniform. So that's where we're at, guys. Um, again, if you have any wood floor care maintenance uh, issues, or you need a evaluation, give us a call. Uh, we do free estimates on the phone. You can send us your information, pictures of your flooring. We kind of give you an idea, but if we do an in-home in consultation, um, we do charge a consultation fee of $75. And if you move forward with our service, that does come off the bill. And clients understand that. They recognize that. So uh, that's where we're at, guys. Um, other than that, hope you guys enjoy your day. Stay tuned for results. And as always, thanks for watching. All right, guys, you can see I already blue taped it. The client did move all the furniture out of the area because 
that is something that, that we request uh, clients to do. As you can see, they've moved it right over here. So every time we do a hardwood service, we always advise you guys either move it or have a company move it. Um, that is uh, the best case. And most clients ask, well, Ryan, what do you do? Well, most time, either you put in an area you're not using like they did, or you could put it into the garage or, um, you know, uh, an area you're not using, or of course you can get a pod. So we do network with a company uh, that can move all your stuff called Sunrise Moving. They do a great job. They come and move everything into area of your choice. They come back and put everything back accordingly, and they do a great job. They give all my clients my pricing, so it's a flat rate. So um, that is a, um, a great benefit of what we do is we partner with companies that know their lane and, do, and can do a great job. So um for information on that you can reach out to us and um and and ask for details but uh what we're doing now guys is uh, we got the product dwelling again this is uh, some quick shine rejuvenate kind of thing kind of material um as you guys can see if you guys look most of the time you, you can see this is what's in the, in the area you don't use this stuff okay this stuff doesn't cure and uh it's not good so only thing you need to do for your floors is to get clean and buffed and use a neutral cleaner. For more information on that, reach out to us. You can check us out online, aoclean.com, or on Facebook or YouTube. So we're letting this product dwell. And then we're gonna we gotta emulsify now, then we can extract it. Alright guys, little tip of the day, FYI, stay tuned. Alright guys, too, I want to show you. You see how it's it's kind of slippery, wet and slickery? That means that the product is working and is actually emulsifying. But just look how slick this is, guys. See how I'm doing that to my feet? That's that's a good good uh, emulsification. So and it's so slick you can just slide. But we're breaking up that product and uh, getting that gunk and that goo off the floor, and then we can extract it and get it cleaned again. But yep, this is what this stuff does, guys. And it shouldn't do that. Polyurethane doesn't do this. This is wax that doesn't go on hard surfaces. Any of that stuff for $9.99 is going to ruin your floors and you're going to need the service. So FYI, look at that. Isn't that crazy? See that white stuff? Here, we should zoom in. See how it's just kind of gummy and white? See that? Yep. All right. All right, guys, a little update. Um, we're mopping this now and tacking it. You can just see the difference. All this wax is removed. Back to the original state. You can kind of see it's how it's supposed to look. And we'll, we'll clean up up that to pop the sheen a little bit. But yeah, you can just tell these floors are clean. Got rid of all the grime, dirt, debris, and uh, that film. So much better, guys. All right, stay tuned. All right, guys, a little update from AO Cleaning. We got this emulsifying now, let it dwell. You can see this side is already done. Look at the difference, guys. Look at that. That's back to original state, no more film. And of course, we're gonna clean a buffet to pop that sheen, just like buffing a car. And guys, it's gonna be, it's gonna be an awesome, awesome look. So uh, that's why it's important to Keep your hardwoods maintained, and that's when AO cleaning, hard frustration, got you covered. Before you floor it, let us restore it. All right, guys, stay tuned. You see all that sludge, guys? Look at that. Responding well, it's emulsifying. Now what we're doing is we're agitating it to break that bond from a chemical standpoint. It's all about chemistry. Then we get uh, extracted. Beautiful. We're going to buff it out now. As you can see, the client moved all their, some of their stuff in the garage. That's what we advise. Just move it somewhere out of the area. We'll take care of the rest. 
looks like it's gonna try to rain on us. All right, guys, stay tuned. Hope you guys are having a good day. All right. Perfect. All right, guys, gonna clean and buff. Stay tuned. All right, guys, you can see how much these floors are turning out good. I mean, look at that, guys. This is the original state. This is a satin sheen. Guys, these floors are absolutely gorgeous. They're, they're so excited. And we're just cleaning it and buffing it now. Look at this, guys. Only a dollar fifty a square foot to clean and buff, and uh, we charge three dollars to remove any kind of um, over-the-counter products like Quick Shine and things of that nature. But if you do a, a combination of services, we do give you a little bit of a break, like I did this client. But guys, cheaper than refinishing and cheaper than replacement. Beautiful. All right, I'm gonna finish up. Stay tuned for testimonial from the client. All right, guys, check it out. We just got done cleaning and buffing. Look at these floors, absolutely amazing. And you can see the buffing pad, how it got some soil on there. And that's even after we emulsified it, cleaned it, and mopped it twice, that's embedded in the wood, guys. That's why a clean and buff is so crucial and important to a hygienic and clean and safe floor. So um, check it out. These floors are beautiful again. Now there is some wear life in these floors, as you can see, because sometimes the pre-finished, when it's you know 15, 20 years old, it does show some wear pattern. It's doing its job. So a lot of times you will see some dull spots here and there, especially in the outskirts or like a high traffic area, which is common, especially through here. So a lot of times after I clean the buff, I always tell the client if they want the sheen to look uniform, I do recommend a, a preservation finish, which we just apply on. Um, and that just basically makes it all uniform and that protects the wood itself. So that's not poly, it's your thing, but it is a maintenance service we offer to make everything uniform and it's still cheaper than a screen recoat, so that is optional. So in this case, I am gonna advise him that I do recommend that just to kind of make it pop and make it everything fresh. Otherwise, you know, a clean above is just fine, as you guys can see, and it's still satisfactory. So night and day difference, guys. Beautiful. A little bit of uh, not as shiny here because of a lot of high traffic to the bathroom, but man, night and day. Wax is gone. Another happy client. Hey, hey guys, good. just check this out, guys. This is actually, we use both sides. Look at that. That's a clean and buff. Hey, yo, let's go. The mask removed. It's clean as buff. I think I'm going to choose it after the measure. Um, yeah, check it out. Nice. Very nice. <laughs> Excellent. So it's back to the original state. Believe it or not, you know, at one point, this is what it looked like, right? Yeah. Beautiful. Hey guys, right here at AO Cleaning. I'm with my client, Mark, and his wife, uh, Trisha. Uh, we're in Maryville, Illinois, and we actually cleaned the carpets uh, yesterday and reprotected it. And today we came out and did a clean and buff and a wax removal. And we actually uh, booked them, uh, booked them uh, last week, got them on the schedule. And uh, we came out about a year ago as well and did a demo, and they're really happy with the results. But Mark wants to speak to his overall experience with AO Cleaning today. Without further ado, Mark, take it away. We had a great experience with AO Cleaning. Uh, we had a floor that had been in the house for a while that had a, a lot of dirt build up and scuffs and scratches that came out. They uh, removed some wax. They did a deep clean, and they buffed our floors and uh, brought them back to a very high quality with a, with a very deep shine. I'm uh, very happy with it. Awesome. Well, we appreciate your business, and that uh, lets other clients know what they can expect to hire a service. And again, enjoy your beautiful floors. Thank you.